what you do, how y'all be, who I be, who I is, what this is, huh? It's your boys, I right? back with another video. And by the title of this video, y'all already know what's going on. We got the young Brad Elevens. Caught him on the shock drop. This pair specifically is from the shock drop. So I say about, um, I think this released like November, like somewhere around the 19, like 17, 18, 19, like. 15 around around the day that the uh, 11s actually did the shot drop. I always wanted a pair of 11s. I didn't get my size because I was actually like in a rush to get them. I was like, oh snap, let me just grab a pair and maybe I can just like, sell them just to get my size or something like that. Clicked on my phone. I put I put it. Um, I think this. I believe this is an eight. I don't know when we unbox it, but I just put it to an eight. And then yeah, I just checked out. We got sent to the house, and then boom, here we are right now. Now talking, let's get into the unboxing. I'm gonna open in the box. I'm not gonna show you this, but basically it's just a receipt paper that's saying thank you for your order with my name, my address, my number, my order number, and it's basically a printout. Um, and then they give you a, a shipping label already with a return if you do want to return it. Okay, so look, check this out. The old box um, used to be uh, catered to the color of the actual 11, so. Uh, if it was like red 11, it would be black, I believe. And if it was gray, the cool gray, then it would be gray. And then if it was the gamma, I forgot what color it was. But it would just be accustomed to the colorway of the shoe. So we can already tell by uh, looking at the box is different. On the side right here, it says engineered and built for the exact specifications of championship athletes from around the world. I'll let you guys see that. Get a closer look at that. Like I said, we got a size 8. I'm not really disappointed, but I'm like... You know, like, why would they, like, change it? Like, I actually like the 11 box. The 11 box is cool. When you open it up, it had that, uh, that dot, dot, dotted, um, wrapping paper. Kind of like that carbon fiber paper. It was kind of cool. A little pamphlet that says Air Jordan 11. The Air Jordan 11 is one of the most iconic sneaker silhouettes in the history of sneakers. It also has some other writing on it, but I'll let you guys read that. actual shoe don't look that bad one thing that I can notice is that um, I believe think this carbon fiber is supposed to be um, dark gray and like black I don't think it's white and like black like I don't think it's checkered white and black I don't know if you guys can see it, it kind of has like a faint white ring going around it it's not white but you can tell that um i'm assuming that they used a different material the leather the actual leather is a bit higher the trend was probably like this mm, i say it's about like at least an inch it was like just like slightly lower slightly inch lower i feel like the leather in my opinion was better on the old reds than uh these new style reds not saying that the leather is bad but it's kind of noticeable, like it looks different. Thinking about uh, a pair of old reds, I don't think the red has changed. This stitch part right here, this part that I'm grabbing right here, it used to be thicker. It still has this traditional thick laces. Laces look good. Laces don't look too bad. This actually feels kind of smooth. They didn't mess this up. The actual Jumpman stitching looks good. Let's go inside the inside of the shoe. The inside of the shoe still has quality basketball products inspired by the greatest, blah, 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 blah. I'll let you guys see the inside. I don't know if you guys can even see that. That might be a little bit too dark for you. you still have your original red shoe tree. The, uh, the inside sole is all red. And then it has Nike Air to the side going this way. It has Nike and then Air with the check uh, going this way. Like if you really know your shoes, then you would definitely like low key tell that there is something different. It's not like too, too, too noticeable. But if you really examine it up close, you can low-key kind of see that, hey, you know, something looks a little bit different. Something looks funny, but it doesn't look funny. But, you know, you can you can tell basically that it's a difference between uh, the this copy and the older copy. Let me stop talking. I'm going to let you guys look at the shoe now. Here's the front of the shoe. Both sides of the shoes. Um, if I can give the shoe uh, 1 out of 10... I give them a B, uh, on a seven being average. I give them um, a six, and a six is just like if I got them taken, then I take them. Anything lower than that, I just refuse. Seven being average, like okay, this is cool, whatever. The reason why I'm saying that is because um, I can tell that. 
they look different. The materials are different. If you got a pair, be sure to let me know in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think on the updated 2019 version. Here's me, boys. All right, all right, man.